And back to command. And can they create something? Oh, keeper to hey guys welcome again to the channel this is the fifa sage and in today's video i'm going to be teaching you guys how to save the broken ground shot in fifa 23 as well as the travella shot as we all know the travella shot and the ground shot in fifa 23 are really overpowered especially in foot so most of them when playing against tough opponents they tend to use this shot type to score a lot so i'm breaking down how to completely stop conceding goal from the travella shot and also how to increase your chances of saving the ground shot so guys if you're new to the channel make sure you smash the subscribe button and also if you want to buy chief for 23 coin make sure you check out skycode.gg it's a secure side where you can purchase cheap food coins and if you use my code fast 23 you get 10% discount on your purchase the links in the description guys without further ado let's get right into this video so if you want to stop the trivial show with your goalkeeper it's all about anticipation you have to anticipate that your opponent is going to take the shot when they get their players into positions like this. So if you can predict when they are going to take the shot, you have basically done 50% of the work. The other 50% is to quickly move your goalkeeper to the far post because that's definitely where the ball is going to fly into. So the controls to move your goalkeeper to the far post, instead of holding down the R3 and moving the keeper to the far post, you can simply just tap and hold down the R3. This is a secret control that automatically takes your goalkeeper to the far post. So when they get into positions like this, and you're expecting them to take that shot you just tap and hold down the r3 button and then your goalkeeper adjusts to the far post and they'll 9 out of 10 times make those saves so if you're falling prey to the traveler shot this is the way to improve the skills and then for the ground shot so saving the ground shot is slightly tricky in the sense that the ball is played very low that before the goalkeeper gets to the floor it has already crept into the net so what you can do to increase your chances of saving this is firstly go into your instructions and change the goalkeeper to a keeper sweeper this will make your goalkeeper leave his goal line and move towards the attacker that is trying to score why is this a good idea because it's all about angles the tighter you are to the player the harder it is for him to hit the target if you want to charge out of your goal post with your goalkeeper you hold the triangle button to do that but sometimes you might not be able to react as quickly as you want to probably because you're trying to defend the attack that's why you have to set the instruction to goalkeeper sweeper so the AI will bring out your goalkeeper to charge at your opponent's attacker when you can't so after this is done the rest part boils down to your ability to predict where your opponent is going to bury that ball so if you can guess the correct direction you can easily move your goalkeeper by holding down the right stick either to the near post or the far post depending where you think your opponent is going to play that shot to. Normally you should be moving your goalkeeper to the far post because that's where most people are going to try and bury that ball. But if you play against advanced opponents they might go for the near post so you have to be able to guess where they put the ball and react appropriately. So once again saving ground shot boys down to two things bring your goalkeeper off his defensive line towards the attacker that is taking the shot and then moving him either to the near post or the far post to increase your chances of saving it because if your goalkeeper is still in his goal post when they take that shot he's definitely not going to be able to save it because the goal post will be too wide for him to cover so guys i hope you find this tip helpful and you start applying them while playing fifa 23 to increase the number of saves you make by your goalkeeper and drastically reduce the number of goals you concede so guys that's all for this tutorial if you found the video helpful please smash the like button and also make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell so you get more amazing fifa 23 tutorials like this thank you for watching guys cheers